Our climate is in crisis. Our health is at stake. Fossil fuels, we know them today as a key culprit behind the climate crisis. But oil, coal, and natural gas have another dirty side effect. Chemicals that show up in the air we breathe and the water we drink. That's because, along with the carbon dioxide pumped into the atmosphere, the fossil fuel process produces dangerous contaminants, including benzene, mercury, formaldehyde, and many, many others. You might not know these names, but you've probably breathed them in. These pollutants put entire communities at greater risk of lung cancer and other respiratory diseases. Worst of all, they put children in particular danger of disorders and birth defects that last a lifetime. The threats come in many ways. Coal power plants spew chemicals like mercury, sulfur dioxide, and lead into the air, pollutants that can then spread thousands of miles. Gasoline burning vehicles around the world emit exhaust leading to increases in asthma and cancer. What's happening below the ground level isn't any better. The process of extracting natural gas, known as fracking, involves pumping dangerous chemicals like benzene directly into the earth. These chemicals, often kept secret from the public, can and do seep into drinking water, putting communities at risk of countless health problems, from cancer to neurological disorders. The pipelines that move oil and gas across countries and continents are just as dangerous. Take natural gas. Pipeline compressor stations release chemicals such as formaldehyde and nitrogen oxides into the air, damaging people's lungs and nervous systems. Or crude oil, which can contain more than a thousand cancer-causing chemicals. Leaks, spills, and explosions happen all the time. When they do, those chemicals go right into the earth, poisoning the environment, including the water we drink. Air and water pollution from dirty energy threatens us all, but it threatens some more than others. Pregnant women exposed to these chemicals have their babies exposed too, during critical stages of development. The result can be children born prematurely or undergrown. Out of the womb, growing kids remain vulnerable, spending more time playing outdoors and getting exposed to pollution. Studies show the impact can last the rest of their lives, with increased risk for lower development and IQ scores, cognitive delays, and even autism spectrum disorder. As adults, they may face an increased risk of chronic illnesses, such as diabetes and heart disease. And of course, mines, refineries, and pipelines are typically built near low-income communities whose residents suffer the greatest risks for heart disease, stroke, and asthma. Bottom line, it's a direct connection from burning fossil fuels to dirty air, polluted water, and kids getting sicker. But today, we can skip the dirty stuff and protect our health and power our lives with clean and affordable energy. In a world where our health is in the balance, the choice is clear. Protect our planet. Protect ourselves. Find out more at climaterealityproject.org.